Hi, this is Andrew Moore Crispin for Gadget TV on Butterscotch.com, and today we're taking a look at the Expand Universal 3D Glasses X103 is the model number on these. You can get these guys for about $130. So this is the glasses here, and this is the retail package that, uh, that you'll see on the shelf. In here, you get obviously the 3D glasses. In this little box that you can see in behind here, you get uh, three of the button cells that actually power the glasses. You get a microfiber carrying case, which doubles as a cleaning cloth, and you also get uh, several different nose pieces that you can uh, interchange here to find uh, the one that's most comfortable for you. So as the product title suggests, these are universal 3D glasses, and at $130, um, you know, if you're in the market for buying some 3D glasses for your 3D TV, it seems to make sense to, uh, to get some universal ones. These are as comfortable and work as well as any of the uh, first party ones that we've, we've uh, had a chance to try. So the basic idea, here you have the standard receiver that's uh, kind of get, getting information from the um, transmitter that'll sit on top of or underneath your 3D TV. There's a power button here that you'll use to power up the glasses. It's the only button on the device, so you'll also use this to program the glasses. You can see in the top right here, there's actually a little LED uh, light that kind of tells you uh, what mode you're in. So if I put them up on the camera here, I'll press the power button. And now if I press and hold, we're entering into um, program mode. And you can also see the active shutter, uh, the active shutter thing happening, blacking out, uh, in this case, both sides. When you're actually watching TV, it would be blacking out the different sides, alternately, um, ideally, imperceptible to you. So like I say, you can actually change the nose piece out here. We pull this guy off. So you can uh, select from one of three or four different nose pieces that are actually included in the box to find the one that's most comfortable for you. Now these have also worked, uh, I find they work just fine going over my, uh, my actual glasses that I have to wear every day. Um, and they're still very comfortable and work quite well. So if you check the show notes on butterscotch.com, we have a, a link to the listing of all of the uh, different 3D TVs that are currently supported out of the box. It is a pretty impressive list and pretty much any 3D TV that you're going to think of buying off the shelf is going to be supported by, by these glasses here. They're also firmware upgradable, which means that you'll be able to, you know, as new 3D TVs hit the market, uh, these glasses will actually be able to support them. Issue there, um, as we gave you the brief device tour, we're not seeing any uh, immediate, immediately apparent way to connect these to our computer, for example, to do a firmware upgrade. Um, so it sounds like you'll actually have to take them into a, uh, an expand uh, service center to get the firmware update applied. That update should be available in about mid-February of 2011. So that's a quick look at the Expand Universal 3D Glasses X103. For Gadget TV, I'm Andrew Moore Crispin. For more sweet stuff, visit butterscotch.com.